Hi, thank you for clicking to watch this video today. My name is Amy Tollyfield, published author and performance poet based in the UK. I am the published author to three books. Uh, they are all wonderful, but the main reason for the video today is to talk about Brixton Nights, which is my latest uh, latest published book and that came out in August of this year. This is a roundup video of 2022. I'm going to talk for a little bit and then I'm going to actually uh, show some photos from the last year uh, and all the great things that have happened for me as an author and for Brixton Nights um, as well. Um, so Brixton Nights has only been out since August um, but it's already been reviewing excellently well. Um, if you go on to um, brixtonnights.com, so that's my second official website, uh, and then you go to the reviews tab or you just type in brixtonnights.com forward slash reviews, you can read the incredible reviews so far of the book. Um, there will be more reviews I'm sure, uh, but so far those are the reviews and they've been wonderful. Um, so that's really good. It's been a wonderful year. Um, the main highlights in February, I appeared in Kirkus Reviews printed magazine, which is amazing. Um, that's something that's only afforded as an opportunity to 10% of indie authors, so independent authors, uh, authors that are published by smaller publishing houses. Uh, they put me in the magazine, they put their review of Bricks and Nights in the magazine because they really enjoyed the book. Uh, so they don't put every review in the magazine, just the books that they really enjoy, which is wonderful. I was in Nottingham Poetry Festival in May this year, and that went really well as well. Uh, performed poetry for my first two published books, The Suicide and Toy Soldiers, and also some new poetry. Um, haven't written loads of poetry of late, but I, I did perform a few at Nottingham Poetry Festival. I've had wonderful reviews from Love Reading UK for Brixton Nights, and also from Publishers Weekly. They were both this year as well. Um, and I also had some great launch events um, for Brixton Nights. Um, the latest was, uh, well I did two in August, and the, the latest one was at Waterstones Putney um, in London, which was amazing. So that was really fantastic. Uh, and I did a writing workshop as well um, towards the end of this year in Derbyshire, and that was a lovely opportunity. So it's been a great year. I've compiled um, some photos for you to have a look at, um, and you can obviously see those in a moment. Another thing that's been good in the last year, um, I mean, it, when you're an author who's little known um, online, uh, social media, it makes a huge difference. Um, and. Um, I'm sure everyone can agree social media has its pros and cons, but certainly when you're trying to promote something, you know, certainly if you're an author like myself who's not always very well known, um, social media has a huge, uh, a huge benefit to it, um, especially Instagram with hashtags and things like that, it makes a huge difference. Um, Brixton Nights, when searched on Google, I'm sure there are other um, search engines available, but when searched on Google, Brixton Nights, if you type that in, my book is now the the first hit and it's I think it's the top three hits and Google suggests that you might be searching for Bricks and Nights by Amy Tollyfield if you search for Bricks and Nights online which is amazing uh, it's a wonderful thing um, Amy Tollyfield just my name um, on Google and Bing and other search engines brings up a lot of hits about my books which is wonderful um, if you type into Google again other search engines available but if you type into Google uh, Amy Poet Lesbian UK um, I'm on the first page is like two or three hits for that and that's amazing it's amazing um, and they may f seem like they're not big things but they are it means people are looking up me and my books and my writing and uh, you know and in that sense the the interest is growing um, and I anticipate that will continue um, so that's marvelous um, particularly for Bricks and Nights and having that to rank so highly when you type in Brixton Nights just as a search um, is really amazing for me and, and quite moving in a lot of ways as well. Um, so yeah, those are my highlights from the year. I'm gonna show a few photos now as well uh, of some of the great events that have been going on and the reviews that have been happening. So um, stay tuned and, and thank you to everybody that has uh, shown their support of me as an author or of Brixton Nights uh, by coming to the events or, you know, just generally being supportive on social media or anything like that, or buying the book, even better, they are available to buy at the moment, um, and always. Uh, but yes, you know, anyone who's shown support in whatever way, thank you so much, and, uh, and have a great new year, happy new year, take care.
Thank <laughs> you.